Hi, this is April Fayetta, and this video is to show you how you can log into your child's Google Classroom. So their login is their first initial, their first name, the first three letters of their last name, and the last four digits of their six-digit student ID, followed by at stu.gusd.net, and it's all in lowercase. The password is GUSD followed by their 10-digit California testing ID with an exclamation mark. Now, what you're going to do is you are going to log in as your student, as your child, as if you were logging into an email. So the difference between this video and the last video I just made is I was still logged in as myself. So what I'm going to do is sign out of this account and all of my other accounts and then I will log in so you can see what it looks like when you log in as your child. So we'll close everything down. Um, I will use another account and it's just like you are logging into Gmail but they don't have an email address associated with their student account. And hers pops up because she uses it quite often. Now this part you have to put in really slowly because if you mess up more than three times you'll get locked out. So remember it's GUSD followed by the 10 digit student ID, the testing ID. Okay, and then the exclamation mark at the end. Then you will click on next. And since students do not have a Gmail, sometimes it will take you to this site. And all it's saying is that they do not have an email. A lot of kids come to this site and they think something is wrong, but all they have to do is press, all it says is they don't have an email. And so I tell them, don't panic, it's just telling you that you don't have an email. So go to Google Home, click this right, on the bottom right says Google Home. It will take them to this page. Once they are on this page, you will see an icon to the right, followed by the Google Apps. And go ahead and click on that, then click on their Google Classroom. Now my daughter has quite a few Google Classrooms because her teachers have been assigning it since, as you can see here, fourth grade. So she has a ton of Google Classrooms, plus the one I just made her last week. Now once you are on this page, click on the Google Classroom that pertains to this school year. And on the stream, you can see the assignments that, or the um, news that your teacher has posted. And the classwork is where the assignments will be. Right here are the ones that she's already submitted and the ones that are still dark purple, those are the ones that she still has to do. So I'll click on one. So she has to watch these videos, write a brief summary, this is one I assigned for her. So she would um, do that, then turn it in. Or sometimes teachers just post announcements and just to keep in contact with the students. Okay, I hope that helps and that you can sign into your child's Google class.